Jeff Hager, the eight and a half. Larry Ricky, the 32 machine. Harry Baldwin, the chief, starts in spot number three. Preston Brown, last time out. He was our feature winner. Starts in spot four. Then we got Marty Kelly in the 357. Dan Carl in the 722. Mike Brown, the 76. Jim Fugel in that number two. George Palmer, the zero. Larry Stokes, the 41. And Jimmy Hyde, the number seven. Accord Speedway, Vintage Modified, Vintage Mystique, Vintage Sportsman. Here tonight, the Full Bull Ring Classic at the Accord Speedway. Larry Ricky and Denise Marco, great job putting this together for us here tonight with all of their helpers. Yellow, yellow. So we got Larry Ricky and Preston Davis up there, and Preston Brown, feature winner last time we raced here in the number 17. The Chief, Harry Baldwin, the 21B machine. Clutch Green in hand. Dan Carl, the 722. Nice field of vintage mods here tonight. 19 strong showed up for the two different feature events. Not sure why we have the... Uh, Semi-single file slash double restart. I don't know what's going on. Maybe they want to go single file. Larry Ricky, here comes Preston Brown. Wow, he is fast. Looked like he was shot out of a gun. Former sprint car driver. Not afraid to go fast and turn left. Ricky Brown and Harry Baldwin, one, two, three. Quickly breaking away from the rest of the field. Do they go? Carl, Kelly, Stokes, and Fugel. Four, five, six, seven. Hyde, Brown, Thompson, and Hager. Round out your running order. Up front, it is still Larry Ricky. The Ricky name synonymous with racing here at the Accord Speedway. Preston Brown going to crisscross applesauce to the inside. Not quite enough that time. Applying a, a lot of pressure. Brown goes in, burps the throttle, puts it up on the cushion, and uh-oh, a little bit of steam or smoke looked like off the right rear that time off of turn four on the 32. We'll keep our eye on it. Maybe I was seeing things. I don't know. You know us how announcers are. We got to make things interesting. We'll watch this time. No, there is a little bit. Not affecting the horsepower at all. Ricky Brown and Baldwin, one, two, three. Carl Kelly and Stokes battle on for spot seven, side by side now. Fugel up to the extreme outside. Mikey Brown down low. Oh! Contact. Stokes was a little bit squirrely coming off the corner. Top three, man, they're gone. Preston Brown goes in and throws it sideways, entering the corner, try, trying to dive down. Three, wow, oh my goodness, look out. Mar Mike Brown, that's the second one he's waffled like that. Before it was Stokes down the backstretch, this time it was Marty Kelly, again off a of turn two. Mike Brown to the inside of Carl, well, no touch, tap, or tangle with them because they were too busy battling amongst themselves. Here come our leaders with a gaggle of lap traffic up ahead of them. Larry Ricky probably begging for her caution right now. Preston Brown to the outside. 
Sends it sideways, drives off the bottom of turn number four. Not quite enough. Ricky slams the door in his face. Not yet, you whippersnapper. Off of turn two, down the back stretch. Ricky trying to set himself up for the lap traffic. Uh, Sparks coming off the left rear now. He's driving the equipment off on that one. Ricky down to the inside, working the low line. Preston Brown tries to follow Sue. Down the back stretch, Ricky goes in. Stokes was a little sideways. Whoa, look out! What a save by Larry Ricky. He was three quarters of the way sideways into three and four. He was looking back at the field, straightened it back out. Preston Brown now right there. He'll go to the outside. Ricky gets into him. Oh! Baldwin now takes over the number two spot as there was contact. Looks like the handling or something may be broke on the 32 because going into the corners, it just twists to the right on him. Baldwin there in the second spot. Preston Brown says, I'm coming back at you, Larry. Brown in that second spot. Wall Baldwin in the middle. Good side by side. Clean racing for the number two spot. Brown takes it over. He'll keep it up on the top side. Lap traffic, a major factor. Spin in front of our leader. Yellow, yellow. Single file restart. Right off of turn four. I don't know what happened, but Larry Ricky back out front. Preston Brown going to try and chase him down. Off of turn at number four. They cooled off the tires a little bit. Two laps to go. Ricky and Brown, one, two. Baldwin, he's got a bird's eye view of the top two. Nose to tail, bumper to bumper down the back stretch. Ricky and Brown. Brown going to dive down to the inside. Doesn't quite make the move. Pulls up alongside. They'll drag race off a turn number four. Ricky from the outside. White flag flying one more time around. Larry Ricky down low. Preston Brown to the outside. Full send. Down into three and four. He'll take it in. Send it sideways. Nope. He got a little loose off a three. And checkered flag going to come out. Larry Ricky brings home the win. Preston Brown. Whoa. Full handful of steering wheel as he came off of four. Finishes second. And the Chief. Harry Baldwin finishing third. Agor Speedway, vintage mystique, vintage sportsman feature winner, the 32 of Larry Ricky.